Welcome back, y'all. At the end of the first part, you guys could see that one of my men got the questioner. <laughs> oh man, I definitely slaughtered that there. Questor, or something like that, ranking. And here, let's see here. Everything's fine. And then over here, nothing really important. A gen turn. Send my diplomat towards the Britain diplomat. Hopefully, he'll get something done this turn. There's a German town, and it's under siege by the Britons. Okay, there it is. Yeah, we want an alliance and trade rights. Okay then, they agreed, we're good. Oh, and uh, turns out Carthage is attacking us, trying to take back their city of Caralis. Which I won't let them take back because it's mine now. So let's see how well this goes. I came, I saw, I conquered. Julius Caesar. Today is a grim day. Let's hear my general All speak. battles are grim. Best you can hope for is to hurt the other side more than they hurt you. Carthage's army stands in the field. They are not worth fearing. They die as easily as other men. The first move in this particular game is theirs, I think. They have a slight advantage in numbers, but our good spirits should counter that quite handily. Bravery must take the place of skirmishers today if we are to counter our foe's elephants. Those people have never met us on a field of battle. After today, they will flee at the sound of our approach. Now I say, this far and no further. Here we make a stand. You all know my worth and what I have done before. Of the foes who attacked me in the past, few ever got to boast of their success. So, let your battle cry be, victory! Victory and glory to Rome! Units, on my orders! We got skirmishers. I don't know what the hell he's talking about, but whatever. And if the enemy... Wait, the enemy has elephants? Oh, crap. Well, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, in campaign, I do a lot of noob tactics. I camp a lot in campaign, especially when I'm outnumbered, but I don't do this on multiplayer, so don't worry about that, I'm not a noob. But anyway, well, depends on how you look at it, but anyway, point is, I'm going to take my r units here, Now I'm basically gonna form a line in front of my archers, basic crap, you know. The enemy have I'm gonna tell them the guard, and I'm going to enable fire at will. And I'm basically just gonna wear them down with my skirmishers and my pila. And then, since my infantry are pretty dang good, I'll probably hold them off. And knowing the computer, what they do usually is they try to, uh, what you call, attack and surround one unit. So when they do that, I'm going to take the units, they're not engaging, and basically surround those guys and cause that whole group of them to rout. And that's basically the plan. So let's see how well this goes. I got some Triarii, I got four Hastati, one Archer. Two mercenary peltis and one mercenary hoplite. Let's see how well this goes. The Carthaginians have a elephant, a two. I can't tell what those cavalry are. And basically, their infantry is a bunch of town militia and some Iberian infantry. So uh, let's start this off by sending those Triarii to my left to attack those cavalry units. And then uh, I'll take my skirmishers and I'll aim at those elephants because I don't want those guys charging me. I'll also move my hoplites towards them just to scare them off. And uh, yeah, I'll take my archers and I'll just open up on some of their infantry. 
So, the cavalry decides to attack one of my units with Hastati, and I'm gonna attack him from the back of my Triarii. And they routed. And, uh, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I'll send one unit of Hastati that ain't in battle to fight off those Iberian infantry. No, wait, those are town militia. Yeah. That are trying to basically attack my general from the back. Oh, wait, those are Iberian. Never mind. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, the elephants got injured and they're going berserk now and they're basically running everybody over. Ow, I just got, that unit's gonna route that because they got hit by the back. And since I basically got the left flank secured, I'm going to come down on my right now and just destroy these Carthaginians. And, uh, yeah, they send in their cavalry in an attempt to stop me. And I'm going to charge these guys from the back with my general's bodyguard unit. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Basically, I'm just going to get all these guys to attack beat this guy now and make him rout. Yeah. Do do do. Kill them all, my moment. Oh yeah, the archers are still in the back. I'll have them open up on those guys from the back. Oh, it's gonna do some damage to them. And uh, God be praised! The enemy king now shows his true colors. The enemy king has been killed. This will surely make his I just killed their king. <laughs> That's gonna hurt their family and his troops, most importantly. Uh, now that those guys are routed, I'll just have them attack these Iberian infantry back here. Yeah, hurry up and rush that crap. Yeah. This is all going pretty good. Now I'll have them attack this General's Bodyguard unit. Oh, and it has a family member in it. That's good. If I attack and kill this guy off, I'll be able to kill two family members of the Carthaginians. Not bad if I do say so myself. Then over here... Let's see here. Yeah, let's charge these, uh... Cow yeah, we're trying to kill the General's bodyguard. And as you can see, the reinforcements are coming, which kind of sucks. But I still have a good grip of my men, so I'm just going to reform them here. Come on, guys. It ain't it ain't that hard to kill this cavalry. Hit him with your pila. Hit him with your pila. Yeah. Pila killed a few. Caught up to him now. Come on, kill him. Kill him. Come on! Kill him! Oh, what the hell was that? Oh, okay, forget the general. We're going for the slingers here. Yeah, the slingers are now routing. Time to reform the line before the Carthaginians get here now. Let's hurry up and do that, shall we? Hurry up, come on. They don't got much, though, thank god. Thank lord, set for the victory, we shall. You know, I'm probably going to take over all the cities now and exterminate the population by building a giant blender in the center of their town and putting everybody in it, including their babies. I know I said that in the Tokugawa campaign, if you guys watched that, but I don't care, I'm actually going to send them now. 
and that's the end. I'll see you guys later.